guys do to combat their their defensive pressure? How do you how do you neutralize some of that in game two? Uh, I just think you know we really just have to uh, you know move it right, move it quicker, move it faster, and you know make the right reads. Guys have to. Uh, you know, everybody has to recognize uh, the passer and the receiver has to recognize, you know, what spot to move into, what space to move into. You know, just make the right play. I think uh, sometimes in certain plays we uh, we thought we probably thought too much on it as opposed to being simple. But uh, I, I think if we do that, we'll be fine. Before the series started, you said uh, one key guy was uh, Rooney. He really played well, didn't he? Hey, he played well. He did his thing. Uh, they won the game. You know he's definitely a talent. Uh, you know he made some big plays. You know along with uh, yeah, along with uh, you know Rondo and Anthony Davis and you know others. So uh, the mirrors it as well. They, they did what they were uh, supposed to do, and you know we had it. You know had a close game with them. You know one minute left. Evan, what did you make of your passing in game one? It seemed like you might maybe a little overexcited at times. Nah, I made I made one bad pass. The other two I would have made the exact same passes. That's it. I made one bad pass off to Anthony Davis. Here. Now, are, you, are you surprised how the first game went at all? Uh, no, nah, not really. I think I was more surprised by us as opposed to, you, you know, how confident and, 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 you know, how well they've been playing, of course. Um, uh, definitely I knew what they were capable of, but, you know, I think I was more surprised in the sense by, you know, we had a couple, you know, we had a bad, Two, three minutes in the in the in the half, and then we also had you know a, a rough couple of plays going down the stretch uh, to start. I mean, going into uh, the start of third quarter. Do you expect the rest of the games to be the same way going down to the wire, each one? Yeah, for sure. I mean, it's the playoffs. I think guys uh, adjust well. I think coaches, you know, do a great job of adjusting, and, and it's the playoffs. I think everything is uh, revved up, and guys recognize the opportunity of what they have, and you know, to advance. Guys ready to get some fast break points. We got stops. You know what I'm saying? I think that was huge. We got stops. We got on the run. Um, you know, I think there's a certain parts of the game where the 50 50 balls were going their way and then it turned around to go our way. And it was just simple things as little bounces and, and the scrums and things like that. And uh, I think that was one of the bigger parts. Evan, you guys had success Does your familiarity with him help? Yeah, yeah, I mean, most definitely. Um, you know, with, with players like that, if you don't see them often, it could be definitely tough just based on uh, not only his skill set, but his poise and his patience. So, you know, sometimes, you know, what I know is he's never going to speed up. And, uh, you know, you really just have to, you know, stay in front of him and handle, you know, just how naturally good he is. He can make shots in front of you, he can get through you, bulldoze through you, and, and that's pretty much it.